This is a growing trend across the country. Courthouse dogs trained to help calm victims. Here in the upstate, we have the only one in South Carolina. 7 News reporter Nicole Ford got an inside look at how the dog is comforting people in Anderson County. Every day, people come and go at the Anderson County Courthouse, but only one furry friend gets to walk through the door. Roma is first and foremost loving and laid back and hungry. <laughs> this four year old girl isn't your average pup. She's been in uh, circuit court, she's been in family court, she spends two or three days a week down at the uh, Child Advocacy Center helping the kids when they come in down there. Roma is the only facility dog in the state of South Carolina, which is different than just an emotional support or therapy animal. From a legal standpoint, the fact that she is able to work independently of me, that she can go under a witness stand or that she can sit in a forensic interviewer without someone holding her leash, um, that is what allows her to work in this setting. Roma's main purpose is to help the children, whether they be a witness or victim. One little boy actually took his jacket off and like covered her up with it and got down to do bedtime prayers with her. Putting them at ease in a situation that could be tragic or traumatizing otherwise. And some initial reservations. Um, we have, and, she, and the offer still stands, she's available to the defense bar if they have a case where they need they need her. And as the trend of courthouse dogs grows, as does some concern that they could sway a jury's emotions knowing a witness needs the support. But in Anderson County, Roma is positioned under the witness stand with the witness and a gate is put up before the jury is even in the courtroom. So they would never even know she's there. In Anderson County, Nicole Ford, 7 News.